Welcome back, this is Montes in Minecraft Village Building, and we're here on the second island once again, and now that it's daytime, I can explore a little bit more. I'm going to start um, putting more torches around the island until I run out of torches. Actually, oh actually no, I have a whole stack of charcoal, so. Uh, with that being said, I'm going to work a little bit more on this island, and I still need to finish the roof on that building. I just came over here so I can check out how it's set up. Um, hmm. Okay, interesting, interesting. Okay. Uh, with that being said, I can put it like this angle, this direction. Yeah, I can angle it that direction. Oh, hold on. My bad, my bad. There we go. Alright, anyways, what was I saying? Uh. Yeah, anyways, uh, I could put the, the roof so it goes like this angle, this direction. Anyways, uh, with that being said, oh, that chicken scared me. Huh, I'm still I'm still quite nervous uh, being on this island. Uh, we, what we need, actually, is a ladder of so some form, and I'm thinking I can just put the ladders here. Voila. Alright, put that there. Put this here, like so. And then... Need. Oh yeah, I do need more wood. Okay, we got some few trees over there that, that um, Apple Demon put on, uh, put up. We can cut down at least one of the trees and start spreading some few trees around. I think he kind of wiped out the vegetation here. I think so, unless there's some few trees over this hill. Is there? Oh yeah, there is some few trees here. Okay, I could cut some of these trees down. And, uh, let's see, that one's birch, this one's oak. There we go. One, two, three, four. There we go. The other island's over there. Alright. Time to start lighting up this island. Oh yeah, the corner over here. Ouch. Wasn't entirely expecting that. I was hoping that wouldn't be such a hard landing, but it was. Alright, uh, this area here is quite tough. Did I pick up an egg? I did pick up an egg. Alright. The sun is setting, so we have to be quick about this. These I can get around the surrounding edge of the island. That will put that in there. All right, nice. Another chicken. Yeah. Uh, if we can get the edge of the island, we have a uh, a strangely good grasp of the island's edge. That means if we need to run away from somewhere, uh, from someone or something, we can get off the island. Actually, that'd be a a, a good idea. Would pro probably be um, getting these mini islands lit up as well. That way, we can just stop here and wait it out there we go yeah so I posted a video yesterday about me using a uh, packet tracer for my uh, CS class computer science I think it's called oh, I also want to cut down that tree uh, I need to go back and see if, I, if some few saplings drop down There's, what was it? It was C, I think. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I, I'm I'm still not using used to using the C key, but it's a pretty cool feature that came with uh with Optifine. I'm gonna run out of resources here. Oh, okay. Ah, interesting. Then take the sand. Oops. There we go. Update that. Update this as well. There we go. Anyways, uh, where was I saying? Yeah, so I I came up with a new a new video. Uh, 
that I'm going to be working on for the next few weeks. If you guys are interested in watching and checking it out, it's it's unfortunately I didn't do a really good job in what am I doing in preparing myself to do it. I just came in winging it in, so there wasn't a lot of uh, work. I didn't put a lot of effort in script writing or stuff like that, so it's not very professional. That's what I'm saying. But it is sincere, and it is hopefully funny to listen to. Or fun to listen to, at the very least. I found it enjoyable to record it. So, there we go. Alright, got this island more or less down. Now time for this dangerous island. And see if I can cut down that tree. Oh! Let's see if I can come back and, and pick up some saplings. I'll be back for this island. Still quite dangerous. Oh, I think I can see some saplings from here, maybe? Oh, I see monsters out in the edges. Come on, come on. Oh, that's chicken. That's the little chick that I hatched. All right, here we go. All right, so there is a tree. and Hopefully we can get some saplings or an apple or so. Oh, I should eat food. There we go. We got one sapling. Oh yeah, this is the, the cave that the apple demon made. I think he was looking for the witch. And I think he found underground cave. Although, why is it not lighting up? Oh, there it go. On an underwater cave. Look at that. That is impressive. Oop. Let's see if we can update the lighting. Okay, there we go. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, this is actually quite nice. Uh, we can make like an underground swimming pool down here. That would be pretty neat. Okay, so that's as good to know. To have that. Saplings. I just saw a sapling here. Oh, I got the two saplings. Okay. Uh, let's plant them somewhere. Ooh, this is a dangerous place. Let's see if we can push back the darkness a little bit. Uh, I don't really want to explore too far out. I'm not in the mood to deal with these monsters. If I'm going to deal with the monsters, it's just going to be this small island over here. Let's see. Yep. There's a creeper right there. That island looks more or less in uninhabited. I have torches? I got a few torches. <clears throat> there we go. Yeah, the island is more or less uninhabited. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Let's see. Well, my guard is more or less down. Uh oh. There we go. 15. 60 sticks. Give me torches. Nice. A lot of torches. Let me put that up. Done. Okay. Yeah, we're going to be using a lot of torches just to light this area up. Let's see. Hey. Yeah, so, sorry I don't have much. Uh, else to talk about at the moment. It's kind of seem a little bit distracted by this. Oh, look. A spider spawn on this either. Can't have that. At least it's only the spider that spawn. Not skeletons or creepers. Skeletons and creepers are pain to deal with. So, spider is not a big deal. Just need to cover my back with a little bit of lighting. Ouch. Come on. I have the upper hand in the water. Yeah, I keep forgetting that I have my torch. Ah, come on. Good reach. There we go. Let's see if we can pick up some stuff that dropped down. String and go back up.
Yeah, if we can at least light up the edges of this island, we have a really strong upper hand because then we can just walk around the edge of the island if need be uh, and access the whole island in that way. That's why, uh, as strange as it may be, if you have the parameter of the island lit up, go. Actually, I like using my access deck. Ouch. Come on. There we go. Light this up now. Yeah, so so let's say for example I have this whole air the whole edge of the island light up and there's like a dark edge. I could go around over here and come in through a lit up area and attack the darkness from another direction and work my way in. As compared to if it's dark, it's really hard to deal with working my way around the island. So that's why it's really important to have the perimeter of the island at least lit up. So that you can have full control of the island in that way. It, it's kind of weird to explain. Um, basically, it's basically you're surrounding the island um, edges, and you're keeping them all in one area at the center of the island. And secondly, <clears throat> excuse me, the the island is mostly lit as is to begin with, so it's not a big issue having to worry about running back or finding another area or leaving the island. Uh, since already you have a good portion of the island that's protected with the torches. So, that being said, let's keep going around this island and torch it up. Yeah, no, keep in mind, like, most of the strategies and techniques that I, that I have learned and that I'm putting in place is not because I'm good at Minecraft, it's because I suck at Minecraft. I have died multiple times, you guys have seen me die multiple times, and it's quite annoying um, dealing with having to constantly die. So I actually take a bunch of precautions because I'm not good at fighting. I, I'm not accustomed to carrying the shield and using the shield, so. That being said, I keep going around this island. And once in a while go up and light up areas that are not lit well enough. Oh, how did he survive? Ouch. Come on, dude. Two can play this game. Alright, fine. Be that way. There we go. Did he drop anything? Nope. Alright, I took a bunch of arrows. <laughs> One right in my in, in groin. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Okay. I think this this part of the island is more or less lit. Except for probably where the skeleton appeared here. Which could be dangerous if it was a creeper or a zombie. Can't really see what's lit and what's not lit now. But oh yeah, it looks like someone was digging out all the sand here. And still continue digging out sand. This could be a good sand quarry right here. We just need to designate it as a sand quarry. I mean I know this island is not very well lit. Uh yeah. Oh, interesting. that up yeah it looks like yeah it looks like he's been digging out all the sand here let's see here we go keep going keep going he's down here it's all uh grassy oh look pumpkins oh yeah i remember the pumpkin okay yeah I, I've yet to put the pumpkin back in the place that it was. I need to look back in the videos and put the pumpkin in its place. So that way it gets to the original pumpkin where it was originally. Did I have? Yeah, I got watermelons. Yeah. Which direction did they look? Yeah, it looks like right now they're all pointing in different directions, so that's fine. 
Oh yeah, I need to get the parameters here. How much time do I have? I don't have much time, so this is going to be another relatively short episode. It'd be interesting what it looked like if I were to drain all the water out. Oh. And I, I have played a few maps where I modified it so that all water is replaced with lava. And it makes for really difficult maps. Because you're you're trying to survive... Uh, you're trying to survive on... Uh, well, what I do is I first increase the water level by like 10 or 15 units. More like... Probably like about between 15 to 20 actually. Not not that low. So so a lot of the, the area becomes uh, lava. I mean islands. So it gets really hard to travel from one place to another without having to... Uh, get something. Uh, without having to to build uh, bridges and so forth, because you can't really uh, ride on a boat to be able to get to another island. Come on, come on. There's like a downdraft of water in that area. It's hard to get up. Let's see. Hey, where were we? Yeah, this this area here should be properly lit. At least I hope it's properly lit. Here we go. Light this island. Oh! There's a stack. inwards here yeah so oh it's, it's raining oh yeah uh, I was gonna say about uh, Thanksgiving actually that, that is kind of convenient that it's raining because it's not that dark that it may be dangerous but dark enough so I can tell where I can put torches down very convenient up it's up but it's down Thing. Uh, Thanksgiving, yeah. So, so I have uh, I have a somewhat of a busy set uh, schedule this Thanksgiving, which is going to be nice, 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 nice. And hopefully, I'll have quite a lot of fun. Um, not sure exactly what's going to happen on Monday, but I do know that other days I'm going to have are all scheduled for playing games or stuff like that. I don't know whether... I, I have, I'm i signed up to game nights, so I get to play games with strangers and other people, and hopefully make some friends, etc, etc. Uh, what was I saying? Uh, let's see. Keep torching this place. So, and and also because most, some of my clients are on vacation, so I can actually give rides now again. So uh, hopefully this, this Friday I can give people rides. You know, torches. Oh, I'm already in the mainland. Alright. I uh, need to go back to the edge. The edge is right over here. Okay. Edge. 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 Yeah, I'm gonna focus on the edge for now before it gets any darker. Get a clock. I have I oh no, clocks require gold, I think. I have gold. I should I shouldn't start making clocks and handing them here and there. I also need a clock tower. I built a clock tower on the first island, but I didn't build one on the second island. So Oh, I ran out of torches. And I ran out of out of uh charcoal. No way. Okay, no matter. At least I got a bit of wood, so let's put one down here, and one over here, and that'll do. Uh, I actually, he, he has the two horses on over there in their corral. I would like to be able to, um, like, use up some of this uh, open plain, because what I want to do, hopefully, is set up a breeding ground to be able to breed very fast, very strong horses. Uh, I need to look up videos of how to set up um, uh, how to set up uh, timers that can 
tell the speed of a horse. So basically, you start on like it's a row of uh, uh, pistons, and you start on one on one edge and like the row of pistons over here, and you click on the button, and you ride a horse as fast as possible before the pistons lock up, and that determines the speed of the horse. And there's a few videos out there that can Eric can teach me how to do that. Okay, I need to knock all this down too. So. Wait, how much time do I have? Actually, I don't have much time left. Uh, let me just get myself up on high ground. Go. Ah, wrong button. Go. I should make this out of sand instead. There we go. Yeah, I'll need to get rid of all this. Uh, yeah. Anyways, uh, yeah, I'm out of time, so I have to get going. I'll just stand here in the rain and get myself all nice and wet. I do need a good shower right now, anyways. So, anyways, so don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Check out the other videos that I have. Uh, have a good weekend, and happy Thanksgiving as well. Um... Or like how my family says, happy turkey day, because we use it more of an excuse to hang around with family members than, than uh, traditional pilgrimage and so forth. Which I find a very, uh, what is it, uh, arguable and controversial and so forth. But anyways, have a good day. Don't forget to uh, say your thanks and so forth. Anyways, oh, and save some gravy for me. I like the gravy. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, everyone. Bye-bye.